Hi everyone, my name is Kim Shimke and I am a beer blogger for brewpublic.com and I have a focus in the Bay Area beer scene. This time of year is particularly exciting because the beers are spiced, so there's a little extra zest in these beers that you don't usually get year round. So let's get to Mbibe. So first and foremost is going to be the Drake's Jolly Roger. And this is exciting because it is their longest running seasonal. Now the style of beer changes every single year. For instance, last year it was a barley wine. This year it is a black IPA. Now this is a bold beer. It's coming in at over 11%. So I call this a sipper. But at the same time, um, it's supposed to be very smooth and very drinkable. It's gonna be very malty, but at the same time, it should drink as an IPA. Ooh, that is rich. Get a nice head on there, because you get more aroma out of the beer when you have some head to it. it smells malty and toasty, but a spiciness very nicely balanced between malt and hops. Be careful, boys and girls, because that 11% you do not really taste. That'd be especially nice with a roasted vegetable dish, maybe with like bacon or pancetta in it. Very nice. I purchased this particular one at Whole Foods in Oakland. Whole Foods is great, but at the same time, you can obviously get it at the Barrel House. It is more limited, so it's not gonna be as easy to come by as a lot of their other beers, but you have to know where to go and who to ask and at some Whole Foods they have beers behind the counter such as the cheese counter and they won't promote them or put them on the shelf which is how I got this puppy so you have to ask. Happy holidays and happy drinking. You can follow me on Instagram and Twitter under the handle Kim's Bay Brews as well as Facebook page too.